I'll ask you how it's going. Yeah. How's it going with the power workouts? Yeah, they're <laughs> I don't know. Like, I'm a little upset. So, Tyler, what's been going on with the power workouts on Wednesday nights? Have they been going well? Yeah, they've been going really, really well. Uh, we've had some really great uh, workouts, if you will. Uh, I just can't imagine anything better. <laughs> <laughs> I can't either. I like watching the little, when we, you film them all, and then when you put it on like social media, on Instagram, where you give those little, yeah. like, the minute and a half, mm -hmm. and you could see what the, the recap was of the week. Even just those, there's like so much content in there. Yeah, so go back and look at those uh, minute and half recaps, they've been great. Uh, but we have some great workouts coming up. Uh, oh, yeah? We have a uh, uh, pastor. Blah, 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 blah. Should I just keep on going? Yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm actually doing the next workout, uh, which I'm super excited about. I'm gonna talk about how not to be a jerk. That's good, I yes. like that, I like that. So there's gonna be like three spheres. So I'm gonna talk about the first is how not to be a jerk uh, yourself. Mm -hmm. um, and then we're gonna talk about uh, dealing with jerks in your family mm -hmm. and then dealing with jerks in your workplace. Okay, well, I don't have any jerks in my workplace, but. <laughs> <laughs> but those do sound like great things to talk yeah. about. Yeah, and then after that, we're going to have Pastor Fred kind of close out the power workouts mm -hmm. uh, with, he's going to talk about baptism. Oh, yeah. And, then we're and gonna, that's connected with a bap an actual baptism, Yes, right? and then yeah. we're going to end it with actual baptism. So it's gonna be really that's cool. awesome. That's great. It's going to be great. So you should come if you have not been to our power workouts. And yet. just watching well, a baptism is amazing, too. Yeah. You know, just being able to see people and hear their testimony and hear how God worked in their life. That's awesome. Yeah, it's going to be good. All right, Rachel, let's talk about volunteers this summer. Yeah, I know. And like summer is, I mean, we're already so far into it, mm -hmm. but we still need a lot of volunteers to keep everything going. Yeah. Because, you know, people travel during the summer and different things happen. In Kids Church specifically, I like to give all of our regular teachers, they take the summer off because they've been serving yeah. all year. So in order for us to keep the Kids Church ministry going with all of our registration and nursery, we need volunteers, specifically Kids Church teachers. And the best part is, is that we give you everything. Yeah. We give you snacks and supplies and crafts. All of those things are all included and you just need to show up and make sure the kids are doing well and the lesson, everything's provided. So it is a great place to fill in and we are in need of volunteers for that. And if you could serve, even if we have every family just take one or two Sundays um, and sign up to teach a class, we would be covered. So. I think that's wonderful. I think yeah. You hear this, snacks. You get snacks, which yeah. sounds wonderful. Yeah. And who doesn't like goldfish in a cup? Goldfish in a cup is one of the best. <laughs> and uh, all you gotta do is keep the kids alive. Exactly, right? keep them alive and yeah. And share the love of share Jesus. Share the love of Jesus and that's, <laughs> that's it. That's summer serve. <laughs> that's summer serve in kids church. <laughs> all right, well let's talk about summer serve in the hospitality area. So we have our greeters, ushers, mm -hmm. and parking. And it's been going great. We have a great volunteer base for uh, greeters and ushers. Right. But one area that we need some more help in is our parking. Mm. And what better place to serve, right? Than right. Parking. Be outside. You get to be the first friendly face that people see yeah. when they and, pull in. And they get like a cool. They get a vest. A vest. <laughs> so no one gets run over in the parking lot. You get a cool, really brightly colored vest. Yes, a vest that you look great in, and you can greet people with a smile. And uh, what better way to share the love of Jesus, right? Yeah. When people pull in, you're the first smiling face they can look at. Awesome. Well, we'd love for you to help out with our summer serve. And where can they find? If you go online, cornerstone nj backslash volunteer, mm -hmm. you can sign up for these things. Kids Church is a specific tile that you can click on, and then the other teams have a specific yeah. tile as well. So, so yes, yeah, sign Church. up. We would love to have you. Okay, so what's happening with our VBS uh, Celebration Sunday? Well, this year we are having the Sunday after VBS just be really highlighted um, so that when families come in and they're here all week and they bring their kids, we wanted to give them something to come back to, something to celebrate the week and everything that we did. So on Sunday, July 25th, we are having VBS Celebration Sunday. So at the 9.30 service, we are inviting back all of the people that were involved in VBS, the families that came out, and to have a service where we're doing some of the music for VBS, kind of just highlighting things that went on during the week, to watch the video. We're gonna have some extra fun things in between the services as well, possibly some ice cream or some kind of a treat like that, a photo booth, those types of things, just to celebrate like what God did um, at VBS and a place to invite your friends to. And it's. It's for everybody. So even if you weren't involved in VBS at all, come because it's a great time to be able to see what God did all during that week. I, that is amazing. You had me ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> the camera saw my face. I was like. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yes, yes. 